going to flip through this deck, and I want you to see one card, and not this one. That's too obvious. Pay close attention. That was too fast. I'll do it again. Are you ready? Mm-hmm. Okay. Now, did you see one? Yes. Do you have one in mind? Yes. Now, do you see your card here? No. That's because you're looking too closely. And what have I been telling you all night? The closer you look, the less you see. Look into my eyes and sleep and just hang out there, wriggle a sec. I'm picturing beach, cocktails, Florida. Look, it was a business trip. Well, maybe the oldest business. Uh, You're thinking of a woman's name. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, J Jean, Jane, Janet. Who, who's Janet? Mm -hmm. Your sister. No. You weren't away on business. You were away on Janet. No. Okay, now she's going to get upset. So let's move over here. You want this to go away? Yes. Okay, pull out your wallet. So 200 seem fair? Okay. And sleep. <gasps> now, when I snap my fingers, you won't remember any of this. And you, every time you see or even think of Janet, you're going to picture me <coughs> naked. And that's not a pretty sight. Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, I am the next great magician, and I will give $100 to anyone who can tell me how this trick is done. I have an ordinary spoon from Mel's Deli right here in Brooklyn. Check it out. Now, everyone, please pay very, very close attention, because I'm about to bend this spoon with my mind. Oh! oh. oh. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Pass that around. What's this? Well, what are you doing, oh, oh, man? Look at this! Looks like we got a spoon and a stem. And I got other tricks. Or you can give me my hundred bucks. You said you would. Nice wallet. You have a very good eye, sir. Thanks. Wallet. My wallet. My watch. Get up! <laughs> <laughs> 